Hi there guys and girls, this is Mary the Lapis Demon with a quick tutorial video in how you can summon untamed but also tamed rideable zombie and skeleton horses with saddles. Ever since the snapshots for the horses came out, about April 2013, I was getting emails and comments asking me how one can get such a horse without using any mods or third-party editors. Now, starting with Minecraft version 1.7.2, you can finally easily summon these horses. All you need for that are cheats allowed inside your world, so you can type commands. For an untamed zombie horse, you need to type slash summon blank Entity horse blank tilde zero blank tilde zero blank tilde zero blank left curvy bracket type colon three right curvy bracket. Please note that everything is case sensitive, so if you see words here with capital big letters, then you must write the word exactly like that. And don't forget to insert the blanks. The summon command needs them to summon the correct horse type. After I told you all the commands, I'll explain to you the meaning of the coordinates, the zeros here. For an untamed skeleton horse, you need to type the same command as for the zombie horse, but instead of the number 3, you want to type the number 4. For a tamed and rideable zombie horse, you need to use the same command string as the zombie horse summon command, but after type colon 3, you need to add a comma, then blank, settle item, colon, left curvy bracket, id, colon, 3 to 9, right curvy bracket, blank, tame, colon, 1, right curvy bracket. Looks more complicated than it really is, just type it the same way and you will successfully be able to summon a tamed and rideable zombie horse. And uh, for a tamed and rideable skeleton horse, of course you just need to use the exact same command string, just need to change again the type colon 3 into type colon 4, so you get a skeleton horse instead. Now to the coordinate system, it works as follows. Let's uh, activate a 3. So you can see my coordinates and my directions. I'm looking here towards east. And if I go into east direction, then my x coordinate becomes more. It increases. And if I go into the opposite, the west direction, then my x coordinate gets less. The y coordinate increases upwards and decreases downwards. That's pretty easy to remember, of course. And uh, the z coordinate increases towards south and decreases towards north. If you use the summon command inside the chat, then it will summon always relative to your coordinates because you are the one that typed that command. If you use command blocks to summon something, then it will always take the coordinates of the command block as relation to what you want to summon, because for the game it is the command block that summons something and not you, although you are hitting the button. Um, I will demonstrate you this. As you can see here, when I hit the button of this command block that has three times a zero coordinate, then it spawns the horse inside the command block. Now that we know that, let's look at my coordinates here on top of the command blocks. I'm here at x645, my feet stand at y6 and my z coordinate is 13. If I would want to summon a zombie horse that is uh, diagonally into this direction, so it would be four blocks into the east direction towards here and four blocks into the north direction towards here, so it would be diagonally land here, then I would have to use this command here. Slash summon entity horse 4 0 minus 4 type 3. Let's try it out. And as you can see, it worked the way we wanted to summon zombie horse. If you liked this video, leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already to stay informed and to support my channel. As always, take care, have fun gaming and see ya!